Hey, how's it going folks? E.T. here. Today we're going to show you how to do free screen recording using QuickTime that comes with every Macintosh. Uh, first thing you do in your finder is going to go to the Go menu and then go down to Applications. And once you're in there, you can actually find the QuickTime app. And what I did is I just dragged it to my dock. Another way to actually get there, you can see it's in my dock right here because I use it often. Another way to go is if you have the Applications folder in your dock, sometimes it comes standard this way. Just click on that. And then scroll through your apps and then find it, that app. And you can either open it there or, or, like me, I use it often, so I put it in my dock. Okay, so what you do, once you open this up, you go to the menu. Let's go ahead and get this open real quick. This, this pop-up will pop up, but basically I just go straight to the file menu, and then you'll see screen recording up here at the top. And then um, there's a little arrow, down arrow that gives you options to switch the mic so you can record either no no audio, and then at the bottom you can also have a little circle that kind of follows your mouse. And once you do that, you'll have this dialog here. You can either click the screen to do full, or once you start dragging with your mouse, you can select a certain area. So for this one, I'm doing a certain area, and I'll start the recording. And then uh, just to prove, I gotta let me open up an image here and just kind of drag it into the recording area. And then after we'll. Uh, show you what the video looks like so okay so I just picked up picked up any image it was a uh, snapshot of my desktop so I put it in in the in the area this that's not dark and is actually being recorded right now so I'll move it around just so we can tell and then I'll hit the stop button at the top there the stop button is always in your in your top menu bar and then the QuickTime player will will pop out with the video so first thing you do is you go to file and record I mean not record file and save and then it'll save as a .mlv. Once it's a .mlv, you can import it in iMovie or Final Cut Pro, and you can use it as as media. So it's pretty freaking awesome. Okay, and it'll save a version. And after that, you can just exit out of of um, QuickTime without saving, since you already saved out that media. And then let's just have a quick look at the video here. You'll notice it's it's, it's the same size as I highlighted on the desktop. And give it a second, because uh, if you remember when I was recording, I had to drag the image over there and resize it. So you'll be able to tell that it's actually, there you go. So this is the what I was doing while th that area of the screen was recording. So this is awesome functionality. It comes free with Mac OS. And I, I just stoked about it. I use it all the time for my tutorials. So highly recommend that you check it out. Well, okay. Thanks for watching. We'll talk to you guys next time. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, thumbs up, and comment, all that jazz. Talk to you later.